this video we're going to go over how to um, save an image as well as how to print a PDF of a single slice of an image. So I'm going to start with how to save an image. Say I have this image right here and I want to save it in a different format or I want to change the name of it. So what I would do with this image is click on it and then I would go to File, Save Image As and right here you have what the image is currently named and here is the extension, so like what type of file it is. So currently this is a nifty file. And over here you see the different file formats that you can save as. If you want like the full image, you should probably use one of these medical um, extensions. So you could change that and it would save it that way. You can also compress the file. So if I want to compress this, I can just put a .gz extension after it. You say I want to call this new image now. I can do that. And I can save it. Click Save. And here it gives you a couple of options when you're saving. Um, you can do which slices you'd like to save. So say you only want to save from uh, the like slice 120 to 175. You can do that. You could also save each image slice in a separate file. So if this had had 255 to start with, so you could have 255 separate files. But I don't particularly want to do that right now. So you could just click OK. So now we're saving between slice 120 and 175. Saving. And then if we go to open, we'll see here is our new image uh, file that we've made. And if I open this guy, You'll see it only has slice 120, I think I said to 175, so it's only part of the brain if you scroll through it. So that's kind of a good thing to know how to do. Another thing that you might want to do is say I have this image right here and I want to um, just have a PDF of this slice. And um, I've drawn a VOI on this image. We'll go over how to do that in the next video. But um, say this is like an interesting area on the image that I want to highlight in the picture. So what I can do is I can go to File, we'll click on the image first, go to File, Capture, slash Print Image, and I can uh, go to Capture and Print Image, and I can either print it on a printer or I'm going to save this as a PDF. And I'll just call this uh, Image. PDF, and I uh, will save that. And then if I want to see how this looks, I can open this, and um, you see right here, this is just a PDF of this slice. So it's a good thing to know how to do if you want to make figures for a paper. That concludes the video on how to save and uh, capture PDFs of images. Thank you.